Hello Aries, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your messages from Spirit Reading. It will be for April 2021 for the sign of Aries. I'm going to pull your first card Aries. We pull a few oracle cards as you know. So what do we have for Aries please? Angels, Spirit's Guides, message for our lovely Aries. Thank you. And remember these are messages Aries. They can be just messages or, or advice. What do we have for Aries, please? Angels, spirits, guides. Okay. First card for you. We have... Oh. <laughs> it's interesting. You know, this could be the pandemic. Um, may well be some opportunity <laughs> to bust out of your cocoon. Uh, this can be about... Um, Obviously, moving away from something that feels safe or comfortable and pushing the boundaries. Um, but yeah, it definitely feels for some of you, maybe that's the pandemic too. Interesting. I know some have been in isolation, you know, different levels across the world. So let's see what else we get. Message for Aries, please. Angels, spirits, guides. Message for our lovely Aries. Thank you. April 2021 you know it's a similar energy in a way we've got embrace the moment embrace this day this very moment think positively today and repel those negative thoughts try not to judge yourself or others this may be harder than you think what is actually happening is that you're changing your energy again there's a feeling of changing your energy or breaking free of any limitation energy that you might be experiencing there might be some opportunity to do that Aries in April okay put those down next card what do we have for Aries please angels spirits guides message for our lovely Aries thank you message for Aries thank you Yeah, I've got number 26, love and light, act with care, care, compassion, loving actions, loving words. But I also feel maybe a love and light is available to you. Okay, and I'm going to pull a final message before we go into the tarot cards. Message for Aries, please. Thank you. That turned over quickly. Yeah. <laughs> Owl, listen to the messages of the angels, Archangel Bokpi. Um, the owl is also a symbol of wisdom, truth. So again, those energies may mean something to you this month. You know, finding answers, knowledge, wisdom, truth. Yeah. Let's pull some cards, Aries, and see what we get for you. I'm using the black and gold Rider weight deck here. Okay, message for Aries, please. Message for Aries. So I'm going to pull three cards and see what we have for you. Thank you. Six of Cups, Aries. Six of Cups is uh, what the message from Spirit is. What it pertains to. We have the sun. Oh my goodness, that's beautiful. And it's interesting. We were seeing love and light. In this energy here, this is love and light. This is love and light energy. Okay, and any action or advice to take from spirit? Ace of Cups. Bottom of the deck, we have the Seven of Swords. Okay, Aries. So we have the Six of Cups here. This is a card of... Um, memories, nostalgia, how it used to be, you know, sometimes we look back, don't we? Um, it feels in this energy, I mean, this can be about joy, getting back to where you were, finding joy. I'm definitely getting this energy of getting back to where you were. Now, yes, there could also be somebody coming back from the past, offering you something, because we do have this Ace of Cups. 
The message from Spirit is what this pertains to, this Six of Cups. Uh, so either you finding your joy again, which is beautiful energy, or somebody from the past, reconnecting to somebody from the past. But it's about to feel good because the, the Sun energy is a card of celebration, joy, happiness. Um, it's also a card of success. The Sun energy, but it's absolutely you stepping into your light, stepping into your power. But it feels good. The sun feels good. It feels uplifting. It feels the warmth of the fun, the f warmth of the sun, the fun energy with the sun. Um, real growth, things beginning to happen. And what's happening here is, is, is feeling really good. So I definitely get this energy of real joy and happiness here is coming your way. And it's to do with something either you getting back to where you were or it can also be about somebody from the past reconnecting to somebody from the past bringing joy because we have the ace of cups you know which is can be feelings for somebody new um self-love absolutely creative opportunities but this can be somebody offering love or offering love again if you're reconnecting to somebody. So it definitely feels, I mean, you know, this can be to do with new love, self-love, friendship, pets, you know, it's bonds forming. It definitely feels very, very beautiful. This is the cup of joy and the universe is pouring love and light into you. You are the vessel. And those lotus flowers definitely represent spiritual awakenings and new beginnings. So I definitely feel for some of you, Aries, there's an energy of a new phase of your life that's happy. Finding um, new happiness, newfound happiness. And it feels very beautiful. The Seven of Swords, it can be a card of... This bust out of the cocoon energy... You might be putting up some kind of barrier. I mean, this can be about staying in the safe zone, can't it? But Spirit is absolutely telling you to liberate from the boundaries. You see, you can see that the child and the horse, they step through the wall. Uh, there's liberation in the sun energy. So I definitely feel in this situation, just don't hold back this month. Um, this can be where we can make excuses, hold ourselves back for whatever reason. Uh, it can be a card of self-sabotage, the Seven of Swords. Whatever this is, the message is, it's about to feel so much better. There's real happiness coming your way. Um, and it feels very, very beautiful. And the message is, just embrace it. Just embrace it. Don't hold back. Because I definitely feel for some of you, this is absolutely guided energy that's coming your way. It's absolutely beautiful. Let's pull you a final card. I use the Messages from Heaven deck here by Jackie Newcomb, but uh, it is whatever heaven means to you, obviously. Okay, just really like these messages for these readings. Okay, what do we have? Angel Spirits Guides for Aries. Message for Aries. Thank you. Yeah, you see, we're helping to bring a little look your way. You deserve it. Yeah, very, very beautiful energy, Aries. So I hope you enjoyed the reading. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. I hope it's a wonderful month for you all and I will see you next time. Thank you.